think we're probably about ready to kick things off. Um, again, I want to say thank you and welcome to everyone here today. I'm Rebecca Michaels, and I'm Director of Seller Community and Engagement, and welcome to the eBay Open 2022 Sneak Peek. It is so great to see you all. Um, I hope you all have had a great summer so far, and you're looking forward to your fall. Um, let's see. We're really excited, excited that you joined us today. Some of you may be coming here to check things out because it is your first open ever. Some of you may have been at opens before and we hope that there's lots of great content that will help each of you understand what eBay Open 2022 is going to be like coming in a couple of weeks, September 21st through 23rd. Um, as a reminder, um, we do have a survey that we send via email after the, the event, so we will want to be sure to fill that out. Now, moving on. So um, we, before we get started, I want to let you guys know about some of the swag items that we will be giving away today. Let's move on to the swag slide, if anyone's there. Thank you. Hopefully you can see that. <laughs> We're really excited about the swag that we have for eBay Open 2022. We have some functional items like a notebook and a pen to write down the tips that you get as you learn and grow um, and learn how to manage your business during eBay Open. And then we also have some fun items to enhance your experience while you're watching eBay Open, like popcorn and a popcorn bucket to snack on during the, the keynotes. So now, how do you get this swag? It's really easy. Did you hear me mention that there is going to be a survey after this event today? The first 900 people that fill out that post-event survey will get swag. So don't forget to fill out that post-event survey after this event. You'll want to look for it in your email and it'll come out right after this event. All right, so a little bit of housekeeping to kick things off. For today's event, we are on a new platform, as you may have noticed. Please take a look around and explore. We'll go through a full tour of the platform in a minute. But for now, you're more than welcome to use the chat and the Q&A function on the right-hand side. eBay teams are on hand to answer the questions in real time. And once a question is answered, you'll find the response directly under the question. If you want to comment to fellow sellers, please be sure to use the chat instead of the Q&A. Make sense? And then, of course, if you'd like to turn on captions for the event, you can do so by simply clicking on that CC button on the lower right side of your screen. That'll open a new frame where the captions will appear, and you can read along with what we're saying for the event. Now, for the agenda today, we'll start the, today's event with a brief tour of the eBay Open platform and all of the cool things that you'll be able to do during the event. We'll dive deeper into some of the eBay Open agenda highlights, and we'll hear from some of the speakers themselves today about their sessions. We'll also tell you about fun games during the breaks at eBay Open, where you can win gift cards and more swag. In addition, we've also gamified the event. And what does that actually mean? Just for attending sessions and participating in the event, you will get points that you can use to purchase swag in a store just for the event. And of course, we'll be bringing back the photo booth as well. If you came to eBay Open last year, you'll remember the photo booth was really, really fun. Now today, after you hear from me, you'll have the option to attend one of two breakout sessions. Today, we have three veteran eBay Open sellers with top ticks, tips and tricks for navigating eBay Open. You'll also have a chance to ask some questions about how to get the most out of eBay Open. Then for the second breakout session today, we actually wanted to showcase the, the type of content that we'll be sharing this year. So we're going to replay a session from me, eBay Open 2021 from last year. Um, it's the kind of content that will be presented. It'll give you a sense of, of what you'll be learning. So please enjoy last year's popular session about therapy called Harnessing the Power of eBay Data. I encourage all of you to join one of the two breakout sessions at the end, and it's a great chance to learn from fellow sellers or to learn more about using eBay data. To join a session at the end of your main presentation, click on the session tab from your left and click on the session that you wish to join. And additionally, we have an eBay open information booth within what we're calling the expo hall. You can pay, you can, um, pay a visit to our hardworking events team and ask them any questions you might have about the event. So I think we actually have a special guest here today. His name is Michael Radlick, and he's actually going to be my co-presenter for eBay Open. He's going to be the MC with me. And if I'm right, uh, Michael, you should be ready to come on camera and give a little introduction of yourself. Michael, hey. 
Are you, can you guys hear me okay? We can, yeah. Awesome. Awesome. I'm Michael Radlick. I'm excited to be here today. I'm on the comms team here at eBay. I think this year it's going to be my fourth uh, eBay Open. Uh, or I've been here for four years, but it might be my fifth eBay Open, actually. Anyway, um, I'm excited to be here today. And I think um, right now I'm going to be giving you a tour through the event platform and make sure that you guys have a good understanding of all of the features that you can use uh, when we're at eBay Live this year. Um, so as we go into this section, I just want to make sure and remind everybody, we're describing the platform based on attending eBay Open on a laptop or a desktop computer. So if you're joining through a mobile device, some of the toolbar locations will look a little different. But for most people who will be joining on a desktop and a laptop, that's what we're going to be giving these instructions on. Um, so we'll go into more detail on many of these um, in a bit. But just to give you a quick overview of what you're seeing in the event platform, here's how it's set up. Uh, the first place you entered today was what we are calling the reception area. The reception area is your home base to review each day's schedule and the speakers um, that will be speaking each day. As you browse uh, the schedule, you can click on add to my agenda. That's an icon next to each one of those items on the schedule to mark sessions that you'd like to attend. The sessions will be saved to your agenda toolbar on the right side of your screen. Uh, and then that toolbar is also the place where you can edit your profile, view your notifications, uh, and read messages that have been sent to you. Below that, uh, you'll see the chat, the Q&A, and, and, and polls. And you'll also be able to see a list of people who are attending the event and who are in your current session. Uh, be sure to check back on the polls tab within the event and during your sessions, as we'll be posting new polls throughout the event. And we want to make sure that we're getting your feedback and uh, hearing what you have to say. So make sure to check on that polls. Um, when you're ready to start exploring the event, you'll do so through the toolbar on the left-hand side of your screen. Here you can navigate the main stage and to the breakout sections. You can also catch up with fellow attendees in the people section. Um, and the event stage is where our keynote presentations will be streamed. So when it's time for a keynote to begin, return back to the main stage by clicking through the stage icon you see there on the left. Uh, when a keynote session concludes, simply navigate back to the reception area and click on the schedule to join your next session. The third section down is where those breakout sessions uh, will take place, which we'll go into more detail about a little bit later. We also have the expo area on the platform. So if you've been to eBay uh, Open in the past, you may remember the expo floor where we have all the booths set up. This year, we're doing it virtually. There's 29 booths hosted by eBay teams and partners, and they're available to answer your questions. Simply click on the Expo icon at the bottom of your toolbar to explore the booths. Uh, and these are designed for you to get your questions answered by someone in real time. Uh, so at all those booths, there is going to be live folks helping you out. Don't forget uh, to snap your eBay open selfie with the photo booth that can also be found in the Expo section. Um, we've also got daily breaks built into the schedule each day. There's actually going to be fun stuff happening during each one of those breaks. I know Rebecca and I will be hosting a couple of them. Um, those will take place on the stage, so don't miss out on those opportunities as well. Um, moving down the tab on the left-hand side of your screen, uh, you'll also want to take advantage of the Play tab, which is where we are doing the gamified swag experience. Uh, we'll talk more about that a little bit. Rebecca's already mentioned it, but it's going to be a lot of fun. Finally, down there at the bottom, there's a social icon where we've added an event social wall. Uh, so if you're attending Open and you've got a, an Instagram, a TikTok, a Twitter, or a Facebook account, and you're posting using the hashtag, hashtag eBay Open 2022, uh, you'll see those posts on our social wall. Uh, we know this is a lot of information to take in. Um, but our team is here to help. If you have any questions about the virtual platform, click on the chat button in the lower left-hand corner of your screen and search the Knowledge Center. The link will be in the chat. Uh, Rebecca, back over to you. Great. Thanks, Michael. That was a lot of information to digest. But, you know, this platform, I think it's pretty intuitive. Um, you know, we chose it because we think it's really easy to use. click around, explore about the content. So as you can see, there are a ton of sessions and activities to view at eBay Open. And I'm gonna talk through some of the highlights that you can expect for the three days. We will be running several sessions simultaneously. So if you have more than one you're interested in, don't worry that all of the keynotes and sessions will be posted to the eBay for Business YouTube channel following the event. 
Um, but I'm sure that Teresa, Philip, and Kathy, who are hosting one of those breakouts I mentioned, they'll have some advice on how to choose sessions and maximize your time at eBay Open in their breakout session today. And then the best part about these sessions is they are interactive. So you can chat with eBay staff and get questions answered about the topic during the presentation in that Q&A tab. And if you have questions during the, any, any of the sessions, again, use the Q&A tab. You can send messages to the eBay teams just there. Just as you are hopefully today asking any questions that you have about eBay Open in the Q&A tab. I understand we're getting a lot of questions that aren't specifically about Open, which is great. You know what? Please come to Open. Ask those questions. We are going to have literally hundreds of eBayers on hand through the three days to answer your questions. So bring those to eBay open, plan to be there September 21st through 23rd, and ask the questions that will help you to, to grow and to power your business. So one of the most exciting parts about eBay Open is the keynotes, where you're going to hear company updates and insights and more from our executives. Let's move on to the next slide, including President and CEO Jamie Iannone, um, and of course, our SVP of Global Markets, Jordan Sweetenham, and SVP uh, Chief Business and Strategy Officer, Steph J, and many more. I know each of these executives well. They're so excited for Open. I keep hearing from each of them how much they're looking forward to being a part of this and how powerful they know Open is for you, the sellers, and for your businesses. We'll also hear from Senior Director of Shipping, Stuart Reichenbach, and he's going to discuss new improvements coming to the shipping space. You won't want to miss that. And then VP Global Markets Operations, Ashish Shabra, is going to talk about the tools that will help you grow and manage your business. We'll also get advice and updates about social media from Andrea Stairs, VP Global Market Seller Community and Marketing, and my boss, a wonderful person. And the list can go on and on. We also have more than 20 sellers from the community on stage chatting with each of these executives about how some of these updates and insights have helped those sellers and, and what um, the information that they learned during eBay, eBay Open, how that will help power their business. And then this year, we have a great assortment of 17 fundamental and advanced training sessions for you to participate in. In fact, for our pre-event survey for Open, you'd indicated that training sessions were the number one thing you were looking forward to, and we heard that. So I'm going to spend a bit of time today reviewing a few. We made to ensure that we included sessions for all types of sellers, from fundamental courses for those looking to master the basics, and then advanced training sessions for sellers who are looking to take their business to the next step. On the Wednesday of eBay Open, we have several great, great sessions, including the most popular topic from last year, which was creating the perfect listing. That session will be hosted by one of eBay's growth advisors, Casey Yardley, who will walk you through the elements of great listing and tips for listing in the new listing tool. We're also going to hear from Francesca Cruz, Global Consumer Insights Director, who will break down eBay's new buyers, who they are, what's important to them, and ways to win with this new segment. If you have questions about Gen Z, that is the place to be, let me tell you. Then we also have our friends at Forrester Research coming back to also talk to us about Gen Z. We love getting their insights on this new generation's purchasing habits, likes, dislikes, and ways to engage with them. Then on Wednesday in the afternoon, we have a ton of great category-specific content headed your way. We asked our category teams to come and give you an update on what's been happening with the category and an outlook for the future. I know we have a lot of fashion sellers with us today and also signed up for open, so I wanted to highlight the fashion category breakout in particular. The VP of Global Fashion, Cheris Marquez, and GM of Fashion, Mary Corella, have an excellent presentation in store for you, and they have some great tips for emerging trends and top categories for holiday. Then also in the luxury category, we have arranged for the whole team to come and give specific updates on watches, handbags, and jewelry. And this year, based on feedback that we heard from last year, we separated trading cards and collectibles into two categories. And we wanted to make sure that we have these topics really covered thoroughly in separate presentations. The collectibles presentation will include toys, coins, sports memorabilia, and also even touch on NFTs. And we hope that these presentations will provide some great insights into your existing categories. Or, you know, if you're looking to break into a new category, this is the perfect time before the holidays to learn more and maybe even get started. Now let's talk about Thursday, where we have another great slate of sessions for you to choose from. Some of my favorites include a session by Parin Gojani, who is product manager for customer loyalty. 
He'll be talking through eBay's marketing tools and how to align your marketing to buyers evolving shopping habits in order to grow your customer base. We'll also have a super duper session all about Terapeak. I know that the presenter is planning on giving a step-by-step -step demo on how he uses Terapeak for his sourcing and selling on eBay using some popular category examples. And we'll also have a great discussion with some eBay employees about eBay's prohibited and restricted items policies, a topic that I know a lot of people are curious about, um, about intellectual property and eBay's verified rights owner program, which is also known by the acronym VERO. We know there's a lot of questions about that, so we brought in a session all on that topic. And then finally, we'll also have the amazing Julie Klein, who is director of marketing for eBay ads to review promoted listing campaign best practices, how to use reporting and how you can connect with eBay ads support. Now, wrapping it up and talking about Friday, we'll have another round of inspiring and informative sessions. We'll have Jeff Michaud from the Government Relations and Advocacy Team to talk about policy threats to online business and how you can join the fight, as well as a special guest from Tax, Tax Act to discuss 1099K policies. For those who are looking to grow their business, either through third-party providers or using the Seller Capital Program, we'll have a session on Friday led by Dev Verma from that team to talk about various programs that eBay offers with David Savelson, who's Global Lead of Partnerships at eBay. And we have special guest Michelle Talty, Director of Business Solutions Marketing from LendingPoint, and Todd Frostad, Chief Revenue Officer from More Com Commerce, who will join as well. And that's really about how do you get um, the revenue that will help accelerate your business? How do you get um, the funding, rather, that will help accelerate your business? And then we'll have another favorite topic on Friday, which is shipping. We'll have a member of the shipping team come and give tips on how to save time and money on your shipping practices. We know we're offering a ton of sessions this year. Um, and last year we heard that you weren't able to attend all of the sessions you were interested in. I alluded to this earlier. So on Friday, we're actually gonna do a replay of all of the seller-led sessions and the training sessions before the final keynotes so that you can catch up in case you missed one that you really wanted to attend. So you can you know, attend your number one session and then come back on Friday and catch one that maybe you missed. You'll also still be able to get your questions answered even during those replays. And we'll be, again, we'll be posting all of those sessions on YouTube after eBay Open as well. Now, Michael, I think uh, you were going to talk about some of the seller sessions. Are you still here? I'm still here. They brought me back in. Thanks for <laughs> bringing us through the whole three-day agenda. There's so much going on. Um, what in addition to all the presentations from our eBay leaders and folks across the company, there are going to be some awesome seller-led sessions at eBay Open this year. This is always one of my favorite things. It's when we bring up real actual sellers to tell their own stories and get the actual you know, boots on the ground uh, intel from our sellers uh, to make those connections with the rest of you. Obviously, one of the big things about Open is always making sure that our sellers have a chance to connect with each other. And these seller-led sessions are an amazing opportunity to do that. Um, but rather than me telling you about what our sellers are going to talk about, let's hi let's hear it from them. Uh, I think we've got a video, so let's roll that now. What's up? I'm Sarah. I'm Anna Packer. Jaron Moore. Ken Gaetano. I'm John. And I'm Brad. I'm Liz. I'm Rosie. Jerry Smith. My story My name story is Anesthetic Miscellany. We are the Posh Kings. My store name is Colorado Reworn. I've been selling on eBay for 20 years. My store name is Big Dreams. I've been selling on eBay for five years now. The most interesting item that I sold on eBay was actually a vintage baby face galoot doll. Airplane flight simulator. The 1954 Rolls Royce that was made for Queen Elizabeth's visit to the Sudan. It's sneakers. I love sneakers. I sell them every day. Be sure to join us for our session, Practical Tools for the New eBay Seller. I'm so excited to be talking about eBay's tools and analytics that are gonna help you make more money in your reselling business. I'll be talking about social media and how it's beneficial for your business. And I also get the honor to speak with the Posh Kings. Join us at eBay Open, September 21st through the 23rd. That's wonderful. The seller-led sessions are always some of the most popular. I'm really excited about all of these topics and all the sellers that we have that are going to be talking during open. 
So now one of the most engaging aspects this year for eBay Open is what we're calling the Expo Hall, where you can have your questions answered by eBay employees and our partner vendors. So go with me here, picture that you're at an in-person conference if you've ever been to one. There are rooms where sessions are happening and you can go into the sessions and listen to a session with 20, 40, 80 people. Or you can walk up and down the hallway and there's booths all along the hallway where you can stop and talk with folks. Maybe you get a pen, maybe you get your questions answered, maybe you get a flyer. So picture that, it's a virtual expo hall. You click into the expo hall, you can dip in and out of booths, you can have conversations with experts. And we are bringing in, like again, literally hundreds of Q&A support to staff these booths. They'll be available all day from 8 a.m. to 1 p.m. Pacific time. Um, and it's a great feature. And, and you know, I gotta be honest, it's a little underutilized, so I cannot emphasize enough how much any question that you have, I, I'm sure that there is a booth there that will answer your question. If not, they'll tell you how to get the answer. Please stop by the expo hall, ask questions and engage with eBay employees. So, um, you know, let's say, for example, that you're listening to a promoted listings presentation and you try a new, ca new campaign later that actual day. You get stuck on something during the process. Well, you can just pop right into the expo hall find the promoted listings booth and ask questions right then and there to find out like how do you get past that little hurdle that you ran into and you keep going with promoted listings or whatever the topic is that you're interested in. So we strategically set up eBay Open before the holiday rush. So I hope you can use this time to try out a few new things, test some new tools and get your questions answered all in hopes that you'll be accelerated for that successful uh, holiday season. So here are the whole list of booths that are available to you. I am not going to read them off because there's so many of them. Take a look. Uh, there's a topic for absolutely everybody. And again, there, there's vendors on, on hand, there's staff, anything that you're interested in learning about. Um, a couple of call outs. eBay for Charity. Uh, you can go to eBay for Charity and talk to that booth to find out how you can lower your final value fees uh, while also donating to a cause that is really important to you. Or again, TerraPeak, one of those, those favorite tools. You know, maybe there's something you have a question about. How does that exactly work? How can you make it even more powerful? Go to the TerraPeak booth and ask those questions. So one of the things that you might do is spend the next week or two before open, like take notes, figure out where you have questions as you go through your day running your business. Come prepared, come with a laundry list, please. We would love to answer all of your questions. And again, they're going to be staffed from 8 a.m. to 1 p.m. Pacific. Um, so it's a great place to utilize downtime after a session ends um, or at the beginning or the end of the day. Now, another way to engage with fellow sellers and create your own community during the event is by joining a networking room. We know one of the things that is, that is the most powerful about these sorts of events, whether it's in person or virtual, is that opportunity to talk with other, other sellers. I can see lots of comments happening in the chat. I saw a lot of people checking in where they're from. Um, and we're gonna have networking opportunities based on both location and on specific topics. All of those networking rooms are going to be open in the morning from 8 a.m. to 9 a.m. Pacific time. So this is a great opportunity to meet fellow sellers, discuss the sessions that you're planning to go to, plot and plan a little bit about what your day will be like, um, and hear about maybe sessions that you didn't attend from the day before, but most importantly, building those relationships, building the community with other sellers. We're also going to end each day with networking so you can meet up with some of the same sellers, chat with new ones about how your day went, um, share key learnings or advice that you've learned over the day. On Wednesday, all of the networking rooms are going to be regionally focused so you can get to know other sellers in your area. Um, this is a great opportunity to, to bond and to make friends with people who are selling in your same area. There's going to be some differences in you know, selling in the Midwest versus selling in New York City. And this is a great opportunity to talk with other sellers in your area who have the same unique opportunities and challenges. Then on Thursday and Friday, the networking rooms are going to be more topic based. And they're hosted by other eBay entrepreneurs, sellers just like you. And again, these, ses these are sessions where you can make connections and learn from other sellers. So take a peek here, jot down a few that you'd be interested in attending. 
Now, in May of this year, I visited an eBay seller meetup in Denver, and I spoke with a few sellers who actually had met at an eBay open virtual networking session in the past and now have gotten involved in their local reselling community. So they made that online offline connection. And um, I think now back over to Michael to talk about some of that gamification, as we call it, for eBay Open and how you can, how we're encouraging your involvement and how you can uh, get your hands on even more eBay Open swag. Awesome. Thanks, Rebecca. Yeah. So bring me back for some more of the fun stuff. Um, <laughs> to make eBay Open as fun as possible this year and encourage your involvement and participation across all the sec sessions, we've uh, come up with a gamified way that you can get access to credits that you can then redeem for eBay swag items. Um, so you'll basically how it works is you'll rack up points by attending different sessions, visiting the booths, uh, or engaging with the virtual platform and using the uh, the features. Uh, the more that you're involved, and the more you get into the eBay Open experience and and use the various aspects of the platform, the more points you'll earn. At the end of eBay Open, you'll get a final ranking on the leaderboard to determine how many credits you'll, you've earned and where you stack up amongst the rest of the eBay sellers who've been, who are at Open. Um, once the event begins, uh, once, you're, once Open begins, make sure to visit the Play section on the left-hand toolbar to learn more about how the game works and keep an eye on the leaderboard to see how you're ranking throughout the three days. Uh, after the event, you'll get an email uh, with details on how many credits you earned and a link to the eBay Open Store where you can redeem those credits for swag. Um, of course, we'll also have plenty of opportunities to win other prizes throughout eBay Open. I know we've got some fun trivia games. I think there's going to be a spin the wheel. And Rebecca and I are even going to be hosting a live shopping experience using the new eBay Live beta. Uh, Rebecca, you looking forward to that one? I am. I am. I've watched a few of them and I've uh, participated in a few that we've had in the past. I'm really excited to be hosting one. I think we're going to have a lot of fun. Awesome. I think so too. Um, last but not least, uh, I mentioned it before, but I want to just do a quick reminder uh, about our uh, involvement on social media. So if you're on social, if you're on Instagram, TikTok, uh, Twitter, Facebook, when you use the hashtag, hashtag eBay open 2022, uh, your content will automatically be pulled into our social wall. Uh, you can find that social wall by navigating to the social tab on the, uh, the left-hand toolbar. Um, you can check those out. You can also go there and use the QR code that's on the actual page to post those photos, photos directly to our social wall during the event. It's going to be tons of fun. We want to see you guys having lots of fun as well. So make sure you post those photos on social uh, so we can see them on our wall. Um, you can also check out the eBay photo booth that's part of the expo floor. Um, it's another great opportunity to, to show how you're getting involved at eBay Open this year. Great. Thanks, Michael. So as everyone has probably heard, eBay Open is a hybrid event this year. And we are holding three eBay Open Studio watch parties this year, which sold out almost immediately. Um, and unfortunately, there's no more spots there. But what we do have is several sellers across the country who've created their own watch parties in their local communities in conjunction with the eBay Open Studio watch parties. I really love that sellers are so invested in their local communities and creating experiences for each other locally. And they're bringing sellers together. And that's really what makes eBay so special, the seller community. So we'll drop a link in the chat for people who are interested in attending one of these seller hosted events locally. And as you can see, they're all over the country in Florida and Colorado and Ohio and Las Vegas. So hopefully one of these is local enough to you that if you wish to, you can make it. And if not, we're going to make the virtual experience just as exciting as well. Now, it looks like the chat has been super busy and I'm so excited that you are also excited about the event. As a reminder, fill out that post-event survey that you're going to get um, in email to get the pre-event swag that I talked about earlier, right at the beginning of today. Um, and we had a, a ton of great questions come through the chat. I'll try and answer a few of them. Um, and so now let's see, what do we have here? I'm going to read one from, oh, okay. Here's a great one from Jason Palmer. Jason, this is an excellent question. Why does eBay not select a larger venue so that more people can attend in person? Other, other um, marketplaces use really big expo halls. You know what? Honestly, Jason, in the past, we did do that. We had in-person opens that were in Las Vegas, um, and we were able to have about 2,200 people attend. 
But you know what? Um, one of the silver linings that uh, that the pandemic unlocked is the fact that virtual is a great equalizer. So many more people are able to interact with the content. And we wanted to continue down the path of virtual because it means that people who don't want to leave their business, um, who aren't able to travel, who um, choose to, to stay at home, still can have access to all of the great content. But we know how important it is to sellers to be able to have some of that in-person experience. And having these three locations and then um, encouraging sellers to host their own means that many more people all across the country, again, people who can't travel for two or three days, are able to have the best of both worlds. It's, it's an opportunity to have even more inclusion and to have even more sellers able to access the eBay open experience. Um, and we're really looking forward to the hybrid experience that we're bringing to you this year. So great question and, and thanks for that. Next question is, um, how do you sign up for each session you want to take for eBay Open Online? You know, what's great is because it's virtual, you don't have to actually sign up. But what you can do is save sessions you're interested in to my agenda. Or on the day of, of the actual event, you can access the sessions via the session tab. I think we have time maybe for one or two more questions. Um, we have a question from Noel G asking, where do you see the individual sessions during open on stage someplace else? Okay, so the way that works is the stage I'm on now will be the home for the daily keynotes. And the sessions I was talking about earlier will be in the sessions button just below the stage button. You'll be heading sh shortly to the sessions tab to watch one of two sessions available today. It's kind of like main stage and, uh, and you know, session rooms, if you think again about what it's like being at an in-person conference. And then the last question is, we had a lot of questions in the chat about whether this sneak peek session will be available to view after. And the answer is yes. We'll be posting this to our eBay for Business YouTube, and we'll also be promoting it across the eBay for Business Facebook channels, as well as in the eBay community. Thank you all so much today for your questions, for being here today. We're going to take five minutes to transition everyone to the session rooms. And before you go, I look forward to seeing you in a couple of weeks along with Michael. We can't wait to host you all. And um, thank you so much for being here. And tell everyone you know that eBay Open is going to be a great experience not to be missed. So go ahead and click the session icon on the left to choose between our two breakout sessions. And thank you so much for your time today. Bye.